Derek Grabner is a man of many talents. A 2007 Carroll High School grad, he's as comfortable on the mound as he is delivering a monologue. A former Ball State pitcher, Grabner's acting career is off to a fast start. News Channel 15 sports director Glenn Marini has the story. We are just talking. He's turning you. Let him go. And you don't even see it. We need to take this guy out. I was like playing the disturbed people, um, people that have problems. He's the enemy. A lot more fun to play. Plus, they gave me a knife. I mean, how cool is that? <laughs> Derek Grabner's role in a March episode of Madam Secretary came to an unceremonious end. But his career is just beginning. I had an agent. Uh, I was going through meetings um, about representation, and they asked me what I had done in college, and I said I played baseball. And they asked if I wanted to pursue baseball in the professional career, and I said, you know, at one time, yes. And I go, so you fell back on acting. And they're like, two of the hardest things to do to actually reach a success level. After graduating from Carroll, Grabner pitched in junior college, then transferred to Ball State. The self-proclaimed goofy lefty majored in theater, blending two very different worlds. It was weird to, to my theater friends. I am the broiest dude guy ever. Um, and to my baseball friends, I was the weird theater kid. So I didn't sleep much at Ball State. Hi. My name is Derek Grabner, and I'll be doing a piece from Little Dog Laughed by Douglas Carter Bean. After graduating from Ball State in 2013, Derek landed a nine-month apprenticeship at the Actors Theater in Louisville. Last fall, he moved to New York, immediately landing his first co-starring role on CBS's hit show, Elementary. Chris. Captain. Aiden Quinn was uh, amazed because I told him I had been in the city for a week and a half. And he was like, and you what? You're, and you're here? Like... It's your first thing ever because nobody, nobody knows it's your first day. Nobody's there oh, yeah. to hold your hand and, so and you're cool. trying to be as professional as possible and you're in a new place going, I've never done this before. Um, but they expect you to be able to perform like you did in the audition and that's your one job. Grabner says baseball prepared him to handle pressure and performance in the spotlight. When you go in an audition, you're, you get one chance. You have to go, go for it. And if you don't, you walk out leaving going, ah, I didn't, I didn't quite, I didn't, I didn't put up my best work. Yeah. Um, just like a day when, you know, I've been pulled in the first inning before of, a, of starting a game, and those are sad days. Talking about your friend, the English one. With a couple of co-starring spots on CBS shows now on his resume, Grabner would like to find a role somewhere on Broadway. It's an acting career that began in live theater at Carroll High School, where he split time between the rubber and rehearsal. Had I decided to go, you know, to the city or to New York right out of, of high school and pursue, pursuing acting, would I be further along now than I am? But I look back and I had a, a fun ride and I like where I'm at now and I learned so much from just the, from baseball that I can put into my acting. It's going to be a hard grind and uh, I learned that from all, all my coaches. While Grabner has landed roles on some big time shows, his living space is anything but. In New York, he lives in a 16 by 9 foot studio apartment with his rent totaling 832 bucks a month. 